It's me, Keegan. Danny, Chase, and Brittany. And there. And you're watching the Smoky Mountain Family. And today we're at the Cancun Mexican Bar and Grill, our grill and bar. Um, so we actually found this place. We had went to Loco Burro mm -hmm. on the Strip in Gatlinburg uh, one day and left there kind of unsatisfied with the experience that we had. So we ended up doing some searching on Google and we, well, the first place we found was actually rated higher than Cancun. We went there and it kind of looked a little sketchy. So we ended up at the Cancun and thankfully we did because we love it here. And now we're going to take you guys with us. So we've been here like three times since we moved here. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. Really good stuff. So here we go. Let's get it. most lengthy menu I've seen in uh, Mexican restaurants, at least around here. Yeah, and uh, so they, they have a lot of stuff that they start out with uh, the chips and salsa, which is what you're going to see here. Here's the children's menu. But here's the chips and salsa, which is really good. This is probably the highlight for me. Um, I'll tell you later on, I kind of have a, I'm, I'm in a middle ground here with Mexican restaurants, but this chips and salsa is always a favorite here, so. The chips are fresh. So oh yeah. You can tell they're fresh. I, I haven't confirmed that, but I think everything, like the chips, the salsa, and the queso, which is what you're about to see here, is all house made. So. Now we ordered queso. Keegan loves the cheese that generally mess with salsa, and JC just actually eats the chips and loves them. But look how big this is. Normally you get a little dish, like a yeah. little dish like you poured the salsa into. This was huge. And this is so rich and creamy every time. It comes out, it's always warm, it tastes so good. <laughs> and here's typical <laughs> Keegan fashion right here. She has no idea that there's cheese. Oh, yes. Yeah, no, she did. She, she wiped, wiped it, it off and with her it. chips. <laughs> it's so good. It is more of like a runny consistency, but I like that. I actually pour mine over what I ordered for yeah. the leftovers. The chicken chocolate. Yeah. yeah. So Keegan got chicken and fries. That grilled chicken, I tasted mm. some of it. The grilled chicken was really good. Really good. Eric just got a steak. And I'll explain that later on in the outro. I know where I like what I like here. It's the chimichangas, and yeah, I just get it. Yeah, the steak one with just rice, cheese, and beans. I told you I ate, I eat like a kid. The fries are good too. They are. They're really good, and those do taste fresh too. Like a lot of places we went, not just Mexican restaurants, they just taste like yeah freezer section. Yeah, yeah. So it's good. It's good and fresh. And again, this grilled chicken man is really. Good. Seasoned. It's it's got a little bit of spice to it. Keegan likes a little bit of spice, and here I am. I taste it. It's really good. As soon as I seen it, when he it was came like, out, I got to yeah, try like, that for the video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but blame it on the video. Yeah. So this is just the carne asada. It's just uh, you know, it's it tastes like just about every piece of steak I've eaten at a Mexican restaurant, which is good. Keegan wasn't a fan of it. Keegan I didn't knew like she it. Didn't. She yeah. was about to get it, and I was like, you should just taste some of mine because you're probably not going to Look at this like chimichanga. This. See, this is the technique. You take it, well, yeah, you gotta have to cut a little bit more, but I take it, <laughs> I dip it in the cheese, and I'll even pour that cheese, or I'll just use it as a dipping um, plate if everyone's done with the cheese. I love me some cheese. I'll eat, and that's, again, I'll eat the chips and salsa just throughout the meal, too. Yeah, so. we're constantly going it's back really to it. good. It was so good. I don't even know how to explain to you how good that was. Like, the steak is just exceptional. I'll normally tell them when they first come out, like, hey, bring us everything. The tortilla is good, too. 48 bucks for everything. All right. <laughs> so, that was Cancun. I'm going to go ahead and rate it. I'm going to rate it a, like, nine and a half. It would be a ten. I love the food. This is one that you can get by with going to if everything else is busy. 
and it looks like they're full, but I don't know, maybe they have more seating in there than what it appears because this parking lot is full, but we got right in. They're super nice. There was a manager, I think he was a manager, maybe he was the owner, and he was standing there the entire time just making sure everyone was enjoying yeah. and having a good time. He came up and made sure that we were all right. I watched him do that with everybody. It wasn't just because we had a camera out. <laughs> so I like it. I think we just got a new waiter, and it's not that he was terrible. Like I've had really bad service in Smoky Mountains, but it was just all right, you know? So nine and a half, if it wasn't for that, it would be 10 every time. We go here time and time again. I rate it a like a because I'm really ticked off about this waiter because I asked for a new bottle of ketchup because it was running out and it was farting. He got me the same ketchup. This is a phobia of Keegan's though. Take that into consideration. Keegan does not use end of end of bottles with ketchup. That makes it literally makes her gag. <laughs> I think we caught a little bit of that. So it's yeah. eight because he tricks me. But everything else is good. Yeah. Jay. 10? Wait, no, 9. Okay. Because the bad thing, no one ever talks about my beautiful dance moves. No one, no one no. acknowledges your beautiful dance moves. They just stared at you like you're dancing. Oh, no. Okay. I'm going to give it a 9. Um, I, I'm kind of, I don't know if you noticed, I got a steak. That's weird. Uh, That's so because weird. I used to get a quesadilla and then I got some tacos and I'm just kind of, I'm in this weird middle ground with Mexican food right now. I'm trying to find my place, you know, with what, <laughs> with, with what I like to eat at a Mexican restaurant. So, uh, yeah, I, but I mean, everything, I, I love the chips and salsa here. They're really good. The service is good. If you like watch this staff operate, they're very mechanical. Yeah. Like it's, I mean, it works like a well-oiled machine. It's, I mean, it, it's something to watch really how the, the teamwork is in there. It's, uh, it, it's just a, and it's a good classic, you know, Mexican restaurant environment. So, yeah, I uh, give it a, a, say a nine. Is that what I said? That's what you said. Yeah, nine. Yeah, that's yeah. what it is. So, <laughs> all, right. all right. Well, make sure to like, subscribe, turn on me. notifications, and <laughs> thanks for we watching. We will be back. Thanks. Bye. Bye.